Hello Master Tax here and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to have a look at a battle from the Tier 6 American medium tank, the M4A3 E2 Jumbo Sherman. I'll show you how I set up this tank, a little bit different to normal. As you can see I'm using the stock turret, that's because it's got 152mm of armour all the way around, compared to 63 on the second turret. But on the second turret you do get 370 meters view range where i only get 330. i'm also not using the top gun i'm using the tier 5 derp cannon the 105 millimeter so let's have a look at my crew my crew all onto the third skill so not a bad crew the equipment that i use on this tank is vents gun rammer and a vertical stabiliser. Let's have a look at the battle. Today I'm playing on Ensk. It's an encounter battle, which means both teams are after the same base, or defending. We've got the 357 matchmaking, and I'm top tier today. Having this set up on this tank, and being top tier, we should do some serious damage here. I'm a bit disappointed I didn't one-arrow him there. But we did track him, get good damage, and we'll finish him off there. Little bit of assistance since he was tracked. Can we get this wheels vehicle? Nope, he's moving. Our loot is after him, and I get him this time. And that's him finished. I want to move now, get down the train tracks. I'm not fearing anybody. The armor should stand up well, and with this gun, I should one arrow a lot of tanks that's me hope are they going to push in front of us here it's not ideal playing at long distances as you can see because with this setup you do get a dispersion of 0 0.50 which is absolutely horrendous you want to get close though make sure you don't miss stuck three one arrow and you never get bored of that with this gun you get only 53 of penetration but it is here che you're shooting so you should do damage even if you don't penetrate try to blind shot there didn't hit but if you do penetrate you get 410 alpha damage so you can see tanks at this level you can one arrow a lot of them I do have with my crew and equipment a 6.61 second reload also an aim time of 2.11 seconds which isn't great and that's him derped and out the game it is great fun playing it like this i'm gonna keep on pushing i want to get right amongst it start taking more tanks out for the mobility of this tank you get 35 going forward 15 going back so nothing special there it's at the end of his day no, it's not. And there's a wheeled vehicle shooting us. Turn me armor to the front, and he kind of penetrate, and then I finish him off. Panzer 4 H. And that's him finished as well. Just reloading, then I'm going to pop out here. There's the next victim. Only 12 hit points left, so there's no problem there. Spot the Kia V1S in the corner. I'll leave him for later. Want to get stuck in, help me team by taking out some more of these. Panzer 38. Can we take him out for Radley Walters? He's just behind that building. Loops. Oh, <laughs> on the move as well. I take kills. I could be on for my first pulls medal. We missed there. T28. Come on, come on. Type 58, we'll get a shot into him. I don't want him getting behind us, so I block him. Do 125 damage to him. Our armor's better than his. We we'll derp him, 104. We're we'll bouncing his shots, but I'm tracked so he can get behind us. And we'll miss with that shot, but he's penetrated. Come on, one more shot into him. Can I take him? Somebody else has. And. Our team's capped by the looks of it for some reason. Can't believe that. Let's have a quick look at the stats. 
It was a class one badge. We've got the Radley Walters medal. This is the first time I've been disappointed only getting a Radley Walters medal. We've got that for our eight kills. We've got the high caliber for our 2,233 damage with 268 assist and the top gun. Top of the tree for XP with a base XP of 1118, top for damage. We made 38,000 credits, that's due to a personal reserve bonus. Plus 5,031 XP, that's also due to a personal reserve bonus, plus an award for the first victory each day, which was a times two. I'd like to thank you for watching today's battle, I hope you found it fun. If you're new, please subscribe to my channel, little icon, bottom right hand corner. And if you have any feedback, please could you leave it via the thumbs button in the comment section below. Cheers.